Welcome to Wagner Online. This short video is about adding full text into RefWorks for the citations that you have exported into your RefWorks account. So beginning in RefWorks, we want to identify the ones that do not have full text. You can quickly do that by, by visually seeing if the PDF icon exists underneath the citation. Now the PDF icon only exists if you have added the full text in yourself. If you've not done this at all, then they will look like this reference here by Carter. There will not be a PDF under it. You will be adding each of these individually. So the first thing you're going to want to do then is to pull up the full text. The quickest way to do that is on the right side where you have the article citation information, you will see a, a section URL and it has a link. This link will take you directly to the full text from the, whichever database you discovered uh, the content. So we are in ProQuest and you'll note on the right side it says PDF where you can download it. So you click here and we can download the PDF. Be sure you've saved it. Uh, go to File, Save As, and just going to put it in my downloads. <clears throat> That's fine. And leave that the title. Okay. Now I'm going to minimize this screen, and I'm going to go to the tabs at the top. I'm going to select RefWorks. And now I want to edit the record. Notice it's still highlighted blue, which means it's selected. I'm going to go to the top and click the pencil icon, which allows me to edit. Once I edit, I have the opportunity ability to see add an attachment. So I'm going to simply click here. I'm going to navigate to my uh, downloads. Was I have my downloads organized by date. I'll go into today the use of triangulation. I click that and then I'm going to go to open and it adds it into RefWorks. You can see that working. Now you don't want to just close out of this, you want to save it. When you save it, you will, if it, once it's complete, you'll see the whole document here. Now you're able to click read and we are still in RefWorks, so it's not opening it as a PDF, but it's in RefWorks, it's in the cloud, which means, you know, if you were trying to get to the full text and you didn't have your laptop or, or the files where you had everything saved, you could still do that because you have it in RefWorks. Additionally, in RefWorks, obviously you can print this. There is um, a link to download it if you want to do that, but you've probably already done that. Um, you can highlight selected text and you can add notes so you can comment and add notes here. I'm going to click to go back to the references. And now on my article that I had used, which I believe was Carter, you'll see a little um, full text icon and that is going to indicate that the full text is now there part of the content here was right here. So now I have the text. You don't see the edit screen until you click on the citation in RefWorks, then it'll open on the right. Okay, let us know if you have questions.